yourself. Didn't your mommy tell you it's wrong to take other people's stuff? The drivers of the ship were ours. Our property. You ain't fucking cross the line this time, you dumb motherfucker. You're out of control and you will be put in your place. Step up. No, come over here. We have an operation to this gun. This shit is getting out of hand. I thought I would wait until the rest of the boys return from the raid. But we're out of options. The new gang is off the rocker and has to go down. already. We also need fuel. The local bandits have it all. I had already contacted their so-called Baron, but his terms proved to be unacceptable. He all told us where they get the water, but naturally the well is guarded. The mirror gone to the place and says we could infiltrate it stealthily. So, party, when you're ready, go rendezvous with the mirror. Your goal is to bring water to the Aurora. Failure is not an option. Good luck, Artyom. I... We are all counting on you. Crest, how's the weather? Grand Fayerma. I'll go back to the post. Uncle Artyom, is this Look. for me? Wow, thank you. Artyom, come here. Look, Grand Fayerma, I have my own canteen now. Well, now we have to ask for Artyom, some water. while you were out, I finished making one more thing for the Tihar. The workbench is at your service. Wow! Thank you! Mom! I'm going to jump in making tea! What can I say? We clearly didn't come here in vain. Got it all figured out? Sure seems so. The radiation levels are plotted in color. Ha! They even have the radiation level dynamics here.
guys doing with no water? While you were away, I scouted it out a bit. Gil says lots of people used to live in these caves. Uh, there was basically a real town. But then the geysers opened up and they all had to flee. As you might suspect, we're approaching the spring through the back door. Well, let's go! Well, the bridges are burnt now. Let's climb a bit higher to get a better look around. The cave isn't going anywhere. What's that, huh? Ah, Shaitan! <sighs> yeah. This place is totaled. When setting out, I kind of had hopes of finding something about my people, if not my relatives. But now I find out. And it hurts. Stupid bat! Teddy. Teddy. Even if this town is empty, still, thank you for dragging us out of Moscow, Artyom. At least I see this with my own eyes. Aha! Uh -huh. Right at the entrance. Get ready, Artyom. Charge the torch, check the filters, and other gear. I have this feeling, a vaguely unnerving one. Well, to hell with the feelings. Here, let me give you a boost. a dumb thing.
That's all of them. Well, let's continue. How many of them are there? Definitely was some movement here. Who made that noise over there?
Well, that was a clean operation. You should have seen their mugs when I started the car. <sighs> well, at least we didn't hurt the slaves. Let's Have some rest. there to control the approaches. Yes, sir. Come here, everyone! 
Oh, we showed them all right, didn't we? Yes, we did. The thing is, their army is in a massive raid now. And this is just... The Baron sending his regards. How many of them are there? 700, I think. Whoa. Yeah, we locked out here. And we'd better not overstay our welcome. We won't get far burning twigs. Five clicks at best. The dogs have fuel. Lots of it. A full tanker carriage on the rails. If we open gate quietly, we can steal it. They shouldn't have many guards now. Can you guide our men? I can. Let's get to business then. Yermak, Crest, you prepare the Aurora. Finish filling the boiler with water and drain the car's tanks. Artyom, Damir, you get the most important part. Stealing that tank. Yes, sir. Good luck, gentlemen. Anna, idiot, Tokarev, we're breaking camp, people. Don't forget to check your gear and prepare before you set out. Maybe we could still negotiate with them. I tried that already. No dice. He takes women as paid. Artyom, the car's near the Aurora. Artyom, we're fixing to leave already, but I can't... Your mark, you sure the pipes will hold? Yeah, we'll have to run them through the whole carriage. Hi, our hero! <laughs> well, this desert ain't so bad after all. You can actually live here. Provided that you have water, of course. <laughs>